Good afternoon. Here's what's making news this Thursday, the 18th of April. A Brisbane man arrested and charged over the alleged drug smuggling plot that caused bricks of cocaine to wash up along the New South Wales coast. Highly emotional scenes at Bondi Junction as long queues pay tribute to those killed in the Mall Massacre. Calls for calm and forgiveness. The extraordinary message from the bishop allegedly stabbed by a teenager in Western Sydney. A toddler left fighting for her life after being hit by a truck south of Brisbane. And the stunning flower festival brightening up the Sunshine State. This is 10 News First Afternoon with Norelda Jacobs. Kaya, nice to see you at 3.30. First this afternoon, the man allegedly responsible for the blocks of cocaine washing up on New South Wales beaches has been arrested. Coming up, why Ukraine is carefully optimistic in the wake of a deadly Russian bombardment. Plus, Qatar, a key mediator for the conflict in Gaza, explains why it's fed up with Israel and Hamas. Also ahead, thousands ordered to evacuate in Indonesia over fears of a tsunami following volcanic eruptions and why Prince Harry has officially cut ties with Britain. Ten has all the news you need with Ten News First Midday and the latest developments at 3.30. Then to get the full story, switch on Gen at 5 for your local Melbourne news. We're down to our... Up next, a look at the weather with Ten News First meteorologist Josh Holt. And here's a look at what else is coming up in your local 10 News First at 5. In Melbourne's 10 News First, a Carlton apartment gutted by fire after a lithium battery explosion. The driver charged with killing five people following the Dalesford pub crash appears in a Ballarat court. Five people arrested after police bust a major global internet scam with the personal details of almost 100,000 Australians stolen and cigarette bandits smoked out of a Cranbourne North shop. Juan, how are you mate? Super excited. You play. Time to check the weather with 10 News First meteorologist Josh Holt. Josh, Sydney got hit by a big storm this afternoon. Good afternoon, NJ. It certainly did. In fact, we even saw court. And that brings you to the end of the news for this Thursday, the 18th of April, until the 5 o'clock team joins us at 5. I'm Narelda Jacobs. You can see me again from midday tomorrow. Until then, Borda, have a good afternoon, won't you? Previously on Nature.